y'all. This is India Rose from the Pearl Girls coming at you from Athens, Georgia. Thanks for tuning in as we talk about how do pearls get their color. And let me tell you, there are actually two ways. Number one is by dye, just a total imitation way. So pearls can be colored. They can literally be soaked in writ dye to get a color. If you've seen wild pinks and purples and even some not so wild colors, they can be artificially dyed. So that's one way. But what I'm going to talk about today is the color of pearls naturally. So how they naturally get their color. So let's talk about how pearls are formed. So any organism that can make its own shell can make a pearl. Now, not all of them do, but they can because they, to make their shell, this organism will secrete a liquid that hardens into a shell. We call that liquid maker or mother of pearl. Mother of pearl because they give birth to the sweet pearls. So, in a bivalve mollusk, if an organism gets in the soft tissue body on the inside of the shell, as a defense mechanism, this mollusk will secrete that same material it uses to make its shell. It will secrete that material to cover up the irritant or organism or whatever it is that's got into their soft tissue body. That is how a pearl is formed. So the color of the pearl is dictated by the color of the shell. So this is a black lift oyster. It is, you know, known for producing Tahitian black pearls. Now, look at the color of this shell. Oh my gosh, there's so much silvery white in this shell, which means black, Tahitian black pearls can be white. Isn't that amazing? They can also be black. And really when we say black, I mean there are black parts of the shell, but there's also greens and mauves. And look, this one even has like kind of a yellowy color, which I do have kind of like a greenish yellow Tahitian pearl right here. So there can be really varied in color as you see in this Tahitian black pearl necklace. Now, of course, I'm talking about this today because we have an amazing deal on our Tahitian black pearls. If you order them, pre-order them, we get them directly from the pearl farm at a lower price and we get to pass that on to you. So there is a reason I'm talking about the color of pearls. Now, it is very interesting because even though we call these these Tahitian black pearls, they are not just black, right? There are lots of layers to colors. And you really see that when we put together a necklace. So I'm just going to show you a few shells. We've got this shell. It's a black lipped oyster. It's kind of got this, this rainbowy color. I've got a shell that has more of like a mauvey chocolatey. So this mollusk would make more of what we call chocolate pearls. Then we have this one. This one just doesn't have a strong pop of color at all, but it does kind of have some greens and some pinks in there. Um, this one kind of has a little like chocolatey mauvey look to it. So really the shells can all be very different. And so that will kind of contribute to the range of colors that we see in the pearls. This is India Rose with the Pearl Girls. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.